Radical. Look at me. I'm using my fancy screen capture for this one. Does this capture my, uh, I wonder, does this screen capture, capture my cursor? You know? Picking Durant's nose there. Does it? That's pretty cool if it does. Not sure, though. So I want to give you all an update on the playoffs. The NBA playoffs, all the regular season games have been played. Uh, a lot of teams were trying to lose to get their favorable settings. Is this me or does Durant, has he put on some muscle? You know, I thought that I thought he was really skinny, but you know, maybe all those games he took off, all that time off, maybe he was uh, just hitting the weights. You know, getting ready for the playoffs. Uh, that's team. That's one team definitely that uh, we're going to talk about in the playoffs here. This is from uh, DraftKings.com, by the way. I would leave a link to this, but pretty much this is the whole thing right here. So you're seeing this. <clears throat> What's different about the playoffs this year is there's a play-in tournament. And I don't know if I even understand the play-in tournament all the way. But let's talk about the playoff brackets, okay? Now, the play-in tournament is for the bottom seeds. But the top seeds, some of these are already set. Let's talk about these matchups here. The Philadelphia 76ers is going to take on the number 8 seed. That's the same deal with the Jazz here. They're going to take on the play-in winner who gets through that play-in tournament thing. The number four-seeded New York Knicks are taking on the Atlanta Hawks. I haven't followed the Hawks that much. I didn't know they were that good. But I've been following the Knicks and Randall. I mean, Randall is... He's doing amazing. That Knicks team, that is going to be a tough playoff team. They really are, you know, I think. So it's, uh, it's really nice to see the Knicks, who we usually make fun of, in the playoffs. And a number four seed at that. So they're going to be taking on the Hawks. The number three seeded Bucks are going to be taking on the Heat. <laughs> oh, you know, this is one of those spoiler teams, the Heat. Just like last year, a lot of people didn't have a lot of faith in the Heat, but they have an amazing coach. They got Jimmy Butler. They got a lot of scrappy dogs on that team. The Bucks are really, really great, though. Uh... Do I think that this will be an upset this year? Some tells me no. I think the Bucks will. I think the Bucks will beat the Heat. I just some feels a little bit different about this Heat team. I don't think they. I don't know. Uh, it's more or less about the Bucks. I think the Bucks got a little better this year, but I could be wrong on that. Now the number two seeded Brooklyn Nets are going to take on the winner of Boston Celtics or the Washington Wizards. If you're the Nets, who would you want to take on? The Celtics or the Wizards? I think I would want to take on the Celtics. Especially since they do not have uh, that one guy. Not Tatum, but Jalen Brown, I think. He's injured. He's out for the rest of the rest of the playoffs. So I would definitely want to take on the Celtics. That team would be more favorable, I think. Now, the Western Conference. Number one seed is Utah Jazz. I think it was close between them and the Suns. I think it was pretty close as far as, like, who's going to get the one seed. They're going to take in the play-in winner of the eighth seed. And the four-seeded Clippers are going to take on the five-seeded Mavericks. Now, these two teams seem like they were on a race to the bottom. Because the Clippers lost their last two games against the Rockets and another bad team. Not as bad as the Rockets. But you know sums up when they lose to the fucking Rockets. I don't think they played uh, George Paul, Paul George or um, Kawhi Leonard. I think they just played uh, maybe like five people. They played the Luke Kennard, and I think everyone else stayed on the bench. So they would make sure to lose that. I'll tell you why they made sure to lose that. Because they were trying to avoid playing against the Lakers. Which, I mean, I don't blame them for that. I, actually, I do blame them. Fucking bitch asses. Bitch asses. Freaking Kawhi Leonard had that uh, had commercials basically saying he was the new king of L.A. Fucking bitch asses. Uh, the three-seeded Denver Nuggets will be taking on the six-seeded Portland Trail Blazers. Okay, this is another one of those scenarios to where... You know what? I'm not going to call it. I'm not going to be that guy. I know... Uh, what's that one player? Charles Barkley. He's always big on the Trailblazers. 
But you know what? I think the Nuggets are going to take care of the Trailblazers. Even though they do not have uh, Jalen Jamal Murray, that's his name. He's one of their star players. Even though they don't have him, they still got the Joker. They got Joke, you know, who's probably going to be the MVP. They got him, and I think they're just going to do it. I, I think it'll be not a not an easy victory, uh, not an easy series against the Trailblazers. Like, I don't see it being maybe 4-1, and one, probably 4-2. and two. You know, that'll be a fun one to watch, though. Now, the two-seeded Phoenix Suns are going to be taking on, going to be taking on the winner of the Los Angeles Lakers and the Golden State Warriors. Here we come to this. Now, this is what I wanted to see. Other than maybe seeing the Lakers take on the Clippers, I wanted this right here. I wanted this. This will be fun to watch, you know? Like I said before, to a lot of people that watched that series between LeBron and Curry years ago, it's just, you know, it's going to spark some nostalgia, right? I think a lot of people are really hyped to see this. Now, do the Golden State Warriors have any chance of taking down the Lakers? Uh, no, I don't think so. Uh, not without, uh, not without Clay Thompson. No. But here again, like, I'm a little bit fuzzy on how the play-in works. I think Golden State Warriors, they got two chances, I believe, because they lock the number, number eight seed. Yeah, so I think they have two chances. So I think they will actually wind up being in the... I don't fucking know. I'm going to have to look into how the play-in tournament, you know, really kind of just works. I, I, I had it figured out, but then I forgot. But yeah, those are your... Those are your matchups. Those are your seedings. Uh, 